I'm Janelle Riley, and you're watching Behind the Scenes. My guest today, our returning guest, mm -hmm. is Henry J. Dittman. Um, and we're here to talk about some of the movies opening this weekend, starting with Iron Man oh. 2. Oh, I cannot wait. See, I'm worried. What that, is wrong with you? <laughs> that Well, I'm hearing good things, which is nice. I just, I worry it has sequelitis. It looks like they're packing way too many characters. Scarlett Johansson's in it, along with Mickey Rourke. Mickey Rourke's doing that crazy Russian, I think, accent. Mm, okay, I, I hear all that. Also, it's Iron Man. It's gonna be awesome. I think the action looks great. Here's my one concern. It's the, the government wants to get this tool for good to turn it into a government weapon. Oh, it's so on the nose. Of course the government wants to turn this into a weapon for evil, but I can't wait to see it. It's gonna be the biggest movie of the summer. It's gonna be a huge hit, and I will see it on the big screen within the first week of it coming out. Sort of along the same lines, we have opening May 14th, Robin Hood, which reteams director Ridley Scott and star Russell Crowe for Gladiator. Uh, I think that I can't wait to see Braveheart 2. Right. Which is what exactly what it looks like. It, yeah, like but, shot by shot. I think it's gonna be great. I won't rush to see it, but as the summer goes on and it hangs around, I'm sure that I will end up seeing it. I will rush to see it for the stupidest reason ever. The screenwriter is Brian Hegeland, who as we all know, wrote A Knight's Tale, the greatest movie ever made. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, also opening on May 14th, sort of the antidote to Robin Hood, Letters to Juliet, Amanda Seyfried's fifth movie this year, in which she, you know, is torn between Gael Garcia Bernal and this newcomer Who Christopher I love. Egan. Now, I have to admit, this one I'm excited about. I'm sure it's as predictable as Robin Hood. It's probably cheesy as hell. Why, are there archery battles <laughs> in Letters to Juliet? Because that's the only reason I would see it. Uh, so just to recap, Iron Man 2, you're super excited about? It's going to be amazing. I can't wait to see it. I'm cautiously optimistic. Robin Hood, I will only rush to see it because I'm hoping for some sort of Knight's Tale Nod. fallback. Tip of the cap. <laughs> and letters to Juliet, I am there in the front of the line on opening day. Uh, and you know what, if I'm not doing anything that day, I'll go with you if you buy the popcorn. So that's a look at the movies opening in the next couple of weeks. Please join us in two weeks when we'll be looking at three of the big films opening on May 28th. I'm Janelle Riley. my guest has been Henry J. Dittman, and you're watching Behind the Scenes. Hi, I'm Janelle Riley, and you're watching Behind the Scenes. Do uh, behind the Scenes. Com. Just add a dot com to everything. Keep it. That's so <laughs> off the cuff and natural. Just keep it. That was a blooper. <laughs> <laughs>